lot about Eddie Redmayne and Felicity Jones during award season, I can promise you that, and it's for very good reason. Absolutely, the two are starting the incredible film, The Theory of Everything About Things, because it's his doctor Stephen Hawking and his wife, Jane, at the time of his diagnosis with a debilitating disease. Care about me at all, and please just go. I can't. I have two years to live. I need to work. I love you. You, you, that, you, you've left her, that's a false conclusion. I want us to be together for as long as we've got, and if that's not very long, well, then that's just how it is. Eddie and Felicity, it is such an Good honor. Morning. I watched this movie yesterday, and I was just a puddle in the theater. It's, just, oh. it's so beautifully done. You two, your, your performances are incredible together. We saw that chemistry. Oh. What was it like? I know it was performance of a lifetime for both of you, right? Yeah, we we're we're very proud of it. It yeah. um, it was something that you you know you feel a great sense of responsibility mm -hmm. because you're playing real people. So you know eventually that we knew that Stephen and Jane would be watching the film. So so we really wanted to do our homework and and, and get to know them and and yeah. bring the richness and eccentricity of both of them to the to the parts. Eddie, we were just discussing it in the break. It is so remarkable to see Stephen Hawking at this time in mm -hmm. his life, just when he gets the diagnosis of this disease about age 21 because all most of us have ever seen is this genius bound to a wheelchair speaking through a device. Do you know what? I was actually at university at, at Cambridge where Stephen teaches and I'd seen him from a distance yeah. in his chair and I'd overheard his sort of iconic voice. You would always, and it was like he always had this this extraordinary kind of rock star sort of quality on yeah. that, but I knew nothing. I was so ignorant. And what was amazing about working on the film was really discovering that story and his humor and his kind of, he's got such a vibrant character, so. And the love Felicity, story. It's the, the love story. I mean, we know so much about Stephen Hawking and his accomplishments, but the texture and the richness of his life that Jane brought in and brings in is incredible. Absolutely. Well, that's what I kept finding, you know, and understanding this woman was this profound depth of love that, that, mm -hmm. that she had and, and that they had for each other. And, mm -hmm. and it is, you know, it's, it's a complicated situation being a carer and, and being cared for and, and how this couple just constantly survived and, and navigated their relationship was, was actually inspiring, you know, there for each other constantly by his side for 30 years. Eddie, what was it like for you when, when he was there on set, Stephen Hawking on set, and Jane, too? <laughs> I mean, I understand there was a little so awkwardness. You know, it. Well, it was, what was amazing, we had actually met both Jane and Stephen just before we started shooting, but um, I'll never forget, on the first day of filming, we were shooting in Cambridge, and I was playing the young Stephen, mm -hmm. and Jane came cycling past, and she came running over to me, and she went to my hair, and she's like, no, 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 Eddie, his hair would be much messier. <laughs> so I just, and it was this wonderful moment of having the actual, you know, Jane <laughs> doing my own hair. It's very special month. Oh, sweet. It's a Good beautiful stuff. movie. And congratulations on all the buzz that is much Lots deserved. You put much heart into it, and it shows. Eddie Felicity, thank you. And by the way, the theory of everything is from our sister company, Focus Features, and is in theaters now. Congratulations. Bravo. Congratulations. Congratulations. It is a beautiful film.